Hello and welcome to Addisa TV. Here's the intro. Welcome to Addisa TV. You know you want to watch it. So I just want to talk about Star Wars Battlefront 2. Now, it's where they that I like to talk about games on this uh, channel for Addisa TV because most of the time I can keep that to gaming time, but this game of the situations have been updated literally every single like since Monday where really, things have been coming out from like the tweets that we've been getting that has really nothing related to what we actually want <sighs> fuck to YouTubers basically not believing in each other. Now we did get a Battlefront update from uh, Solo Silo Star Wars. Now I I don't know if it's old or new. At this point, honestly, I don't care. It seems to me he has a constant show to one, and he wants to do it at least every week if he can. Um, possibly get another one if there's actual news, but. One thing I want to hit on is that Battlefront updates. Um, one thing I've noticed is that recently is that he has gave off hints of, of talking about another Battlefront YouTuber that says it makes up lies. So look, I've already talked about this. I have. I've already talked about that. It's the voice actor to blame, not the YouTuber, because if the voice actor said. Like, um, look, I'm definite it's Matthew Wood who said this, that Obi-Wan Kenobi would be voiced by James Arnold Taylor, and apparently it's not yet. Now, we can definitely confirm that General Grievous will be voiced by Matthew Wood, um, because there's been so much evidence that it will be fucking stupid for it not to be, and yeah, now if you don't know, Battle for Updates has also caused... Um, a little bit of drama in the past. Another YouTuber that I'd forgotten the name on uh, basically uh, used some footage of, uh, of Star Wars Battlefront 2 from another channel and then Battlefront updates basically kind of went on a rant or something and treated these treats at this YouTuber for using the footage that I guess he was not supposed to. But um, Honestly, when it comes to gaming for Tish, um, unless it's kind of like, I don't know, actual cinematic stuff, then I don't see it where it's not a problem. People can use my footage on my Addy's Games channel when I uh, play Bath 1 2 or any game because I don't own like the game. I don't. Like the people who made it, it's kind of like uh, dice. Critical, those people, those are the ones who owe it. So, again, all of that, I know it was a long time ago, but I want to share my thoughts with it, say that, that, that that's just ridiculous. And I just want to say, mouth but updates, uh, you know, I will check back to see how many subscribers you have, do a channel with you on you, and talk more about you then because. It wasn't the YouTuber's fault, it was the voice actor's fault. Why don't you get that? Anyway, so I just wanted to get that on my head because when I first watched that video, it fucking frustrated me, like, so bad. Uh, this is why I prefer Star Wars HQ and Silo Star Wars because those people <laughs> don't talk trash about other YouTubers in their new stuff. Even though you didn't, I don't know. Anyway, going on to other happy and non-happy stuff, that Yex TV will be going away next week for the next two weeks. Quite dreadful, not as dreadful as Battlefront 2, but unlike Battlefront 2, you will be getting stuff starting from next week that I plan to do. Related Yex TV videos, but not so much that I can still put them on the fan channel which is on uh, Bitchu. Um, so yeah, that's basically my plan. I've already got a video ready for the 6th of August or whenever it goes away. And yeah, um, so yeah. If you're wondering, but hey, really? 
then why did he say that in the first place? And finally, just with some updates, uh, I'm working on the big channel with you thing. I've started filming for it, so I need to put down notes to camera, but I'm waiting for Dino to release his video on uh, Friday. I'm only going to do this once I am, um, because he's going to be talking about FidCon, and if so, if he mentions the word XCV, then it's going to be good, but it will also be uh, interesting, it will be, so that's that. Second, I am working on the last Jedi Week Awaken trailer, I am. I'm going to try and continue some filming with this today, but I want to get whatever I film now out whilst I still can. And yeah, and finally, you may have noticed that I'm pushing the channel reviews up to go a bit more faster. Well, truly enough, I've got up to episode 29, all of them are ready. So I'm trying to get them out a bit more faster. So there is a possibility you could get another one on Thursday and then I don't know when the final one will be because I'm bad at counting. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I know this uh, episode was a bit, was a bit, you know, heated, but let's just say uh, hopefully August will bring some light to things when it comes to Battlefront 2 because... <sighs> Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Peace, guys. See ya.